Hey, what's going on, everybody? Blades for here and today for you guys another video of Black Clover Mobile. Inside today's video, guys, we are going to be using my current offense team here, which is a double speed team, but not the double speed team that you think I'm using. Instead, we're going to be using William and Baltos as on the thumbnail here, and we're going to be checking out a little bit with our Mars and our Julius as well. So now these two characters that we've been using has been pretty decent. I am actually wondering. I think I took my gear off uh, or something. Yeah, I did. Um, but. Our two guards here are pretty dang good here, and we've been rocking this offensive team for quite a little bit. Now, the main reason that we've been doing this is because of a good old friend of mine named McBurn. You guys have heard me talk to, or at least talk about them um, quite a lot here. He recommended me this little team here, and I decided to give it a shot, and I'm not going to lie. I kind of do like it. Definitely do vibe out with it. It's pretty dang good. Um, it has its downsides, but it definitely has a lot of upsides with it. Now, with the gear, of course, we're running two speed gears here on our characters. Our Mars is running his triple set being attack, defense, and speed here. And then our Julius, as usual, is using his DPS set. But instead of actually using full DPS, I actually ended up replacing one of our pieces here, which now is our defense piece. I think our Noel had our old piece, which is someplace down here. I think it was this one. Yes, had our old piece, gave Noel this one, and I ended up taking this one instead. Now, we do have to upgrade it a little bit more, I think. Let me go ahead and check the uh, uh, enhancements here. But so far, we're doing pretty decent. Like, we have the crit damage pretty high. We also have at least 4% on here. I want to get this to 5%, and I definitely want to get that crit damage a little bit higher so we can at least give uh, our man Julius the 80% crit damage there that we do so need. But all right, we're going to go ahead and get into the video. It's fairly, fairly simple to see what we can do here. Um, I am kind of afraid of this person because this person looks kind of dang strong. But for the most part, this team actually works out like a charm. As long as you don't have another person who can pretty much boost up their entire team, you can be pretty much safe. And that's what I kind of like about it the most. So what we're going to immediately focus on is trying to kill that Julius, get the bonk, get the kill off immediately. So now that he's gone, we're going to go ahead and use our second one to boost up our entire team once again here. Everyone's boosting on up. Of course, the, the actual William's gonna catch up with us, but that's perfectly fine here. We're gonna then use our ultimate on him once again. Boom, get another kill. Then we're gonna try to push everyone back. And at this point, we're pretty much good. Now, the only thing I do hate is stall teams like these here, because we do have to deal with Radies. Uh, we have Radies, we have Charmy. It's not gonna be a very fun fight, to be honest. Um, if I can go ahead and kill off Charmy, I think I might be in the clear, but I don't think I can kill her in time just yet. So we're going to try it. Bonk. Yeah, no, it's just not going to happen. So um, unfortunately, he outsped us a little bit, which definitely sucks, but can't really do much in this nature. I'm just going to try and keep him taunted here, and I'm going to just go ahead and focus her as much as possible, because this is the only thing that I don't like about the team here is you are focused on just having Julius do all your damage. If they have more than enough people who are defending, it can very much so be a problem because in this part, at least at this point, they can sit back, relax, and just literally just kind of rock us, at least until we lose enough health. Um, that's not something that you always want to deal with here, especially for me, because this is not a team I really like. As you can tell, it's just literally me poking until I get the kill off and which is going to take me ages to do so because look at this. Look at this crap. She gets the HP recovery, then she heals again, and it's just constant back and forth. And since I'm taunted, I can't do absolutely anything, so I have to try and get rid of her. So bonk, get her as low as possible. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use the combined attack here. And with this, for the most part, I guess we're looking kind of decent. I don't like that. Why? Why? Why would you heal again? God dang it. Um, don't like that she's thinking keeps mm -hmm. healing, though. So um, we are going to have to try to knock her out a little bit quicker than this because it's not looking good. But um, we're mainly doing this video, this last video before B Asta just well does drop you guys are probably going to see me do a couple videos tomorrow or at least a video tomorrow if i get off work um in which we're probably that's probably going to be around like six o'clock est um in the afternoon so if you guys do want to tune in for that be sure to look at it we're going to be trying to literally get black Asta his card and dip up out of there as fast as possible um i'm not interested in getting too many dupes to be honest if i can get him two star that's awesome but even then i don't really want to use my universal dupes so if we can somehow get his card and two dupes immediately, that would be great. Um, but I don't know if that's going to happen too often. It's going to be very, very interesting to see exactly how this pans out for the most part. 
but I do feel like it's going to be a fun time. Now, a lot of you guys saw my video where, of course, I was talking about Mira Leona and Black Asta. Um, one of the main things I do have to state when it does come down to those type of videos is I utterly detest doing them. It's not a fun time. OK, I don't ever have a fun time doing those videos. And it's only just because every stinking time someone's going to have an opinion. It's just it is what it is. It's something that happens. The comparisons, the power scaling is always a deal inside of uh, games like these, of course. And it's kind of the main reason I hate doing those type of videos, but they are very helpful when it does come down to the eye. Now, some of you guys, of course, are going to still just say, forget that Black Ops is trash. Don't need them. Um, some of you guys are probably going to summon on them anyways. And I got to say to all of you, good freaking luck, because it's going to be a fun time. Nevertheless, it's going to be a fun time to me. Um, I can't wait to see if I can actually pull the man, at least. Um, our season three summons were not too good to be honest i know a lot of you guys saw those and my pain was immeasurable so um we're gonna hopefully get some better luck than what we got then and uh it's gonna be fairly interesting to see what we can do now i hate this thinking noel this noel is the bane of my existence or well the bane of any magic attacker's existence because quite literally she's just a nuisance to stay here and the fact that she also has the sp down too it makes it even worse because I technically can't get rid of her by just smacking her to death until she legit has no cover. So let's see, can I get the kill off now? I think I can, right? Let's get the defense down here. Yep, let's get that defense down. Let's do smack and there we go, she's gone. Cool, love it. And this team is pretty interesting. I do like it, but as I stated earlier, it's just not one of them teams that I would be using after Biasta comes or further in. Mainly just because, I'm sorry, as much as I love the speed, right? I love speed from William. William's always going to be a staple. But, Balto's having here, there's already two squishies. Because you have a supporter, you have another supporter. And that's where things get a little bit hasty. Um, seeing that both characters are usually using a speed set, which most likely your William's going to be using a four-piece set. Unless you're using the defense speed and I want to say maybe if you want to go for extra tanky defense speed and crit resistance or something like that or defense speed and health. Um, normally, it's just going to be straight up squishy bill for both of your supporters. Not going to be a fun time. So I don't know. I don't know how I feel just yet. I do feel like this team here has a mimosa. And I'm probably walking into death, but we're going to go ahead and give it a shot. So let's see what we can do here. See if we can get another kill. Oh, oh, no, this isn't the Mimosa team. Oh, it's this one. Okay, so um, first things first, I don't want to deal with you. You got to go. You you just got to go. No stalling. Um, And then second, we're just going to try our hardest to keep Julius at bay because he is using a defense gear. Yep, so of course he is going to survive that. And then I need to keep everyone kind of at bay here, so... The stun. Let's go. We got the triple stun. I'll take that. So, um, Julius is going to be a little bit of a problem for us. Same as that stinking, uh, Charming. So, I got to figure out a way to take out both of them. Because the issue is here is Julius will actually wreck our crap. And that's not something I really want to deal with. But, um, use this. Uh, keep that down here. Let's use this to make sure he focuses our Mars here. Seeing that he is a defense Julius, he isn't going to deal much damage here. I'm going to try to chip these two down and see what happens. There we go. Let's go. Okay, so I think we actually got this. Oh, no, I need more attack on my William. It's kind of one of the reasons I feel like I need to run a uh, triple set William instead of this double set, or at least this uh, one set here, because it's just not a good look if, of course, you can't get that kill off. But um, let's go ahead and get our boost. And then I'm going to go ahead and kill off her. What, what the heck she lived again that increased defense is crazy that is insane i generally thought she was gone um push back please there we go she goes bye bye now we're in the clear again <laughs> Christ. i don't like this team it is only just because like with the proper setup you can be the biggest troll on the block i'm not even gonna freaking lie to you proper setup is just going to be a nuisance to get rid of and it's not going to be a fun time because quite literally they're going to keep healing there you're not going to do enough damage and it's just going to be a stall fest until you die 
Um, I really want to kill off that Julius. So yeah, there you go. Boom, cool, quick, easy. Tree, please. Okay, no tree. Gotta love it. All right. And then we're just gonna go ahead and focus this dude here. Yeah. I feel like that might be a mistake actually, because like if he does enough damage to us, we could get screwed. So let's just quickly do that. Didn't focus him. All right, this is easy win. Pretty decent. Team's pretty solid. Gotta love it. Um, only patch holes, or at least the problems I see with this team, as I stated, it's too much speed, too much squish squish. Um, the only ones that you're gonna be relying on is Mars, and of course, Julius. It's not gonna be a pretty time for you. So, um, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna save the rest of my tickets because, of course, we do know that the reset is coming tomorrow. Um, for at least every monday and junk like that so um that's gonna be fairly fairly interesting to see how that goes i'm praying i get good luck when it comes down to uh black ops to jumping in here and uh hopefully you guys if you are summoning get some good luck as well i'm gonna go ahead and use all my stamina to uh go ahead and grind some gear before he gets here and uh i'll talk to you guys later stay safe stay sharp stay determined peace out